A new Windows 11 update has once again broken the OS. Oh, what a shocker this is indeed. I mean, who could expect such poor performance from the Windows 11 development team because they had such a great track record, right? Users report issues such as the update failing to install, which sounds pretty good to me, printers not being detected, and slower file transfers by around 40%. At least that's what Microsoft said, while some users are experiencing even worse performance. Just like you will experience worse performance if you don't follow this channel for the optimum amount of the tech news. Hopefully Microsoft at some point just decides to restructure their process of making, releasing, and inevitably fixing their updates. So there's really not that much you can say about Microsoft's Windows updates these days. Of course, Windows 11 specifically has more issues. That's because Microsoft released it way too soon and they're just basically beta testing their entire user base because that's what they do. Um, and unfortunately, the big issue with Windows in general these days is that there's just too much, too many features and everything is just so intertwined with each other. So, you know, you have such persistent issues, uh, such as printers, for example, not being able to work. So they constantly break printers do not work on Windows and then they constantly fix them and new problems just come out of the blue and break them again. For instance, now a new printer policy was leading to printers being not detected. So there's constantly just a bunch of issues and the unfortunate thing that Microsoft is doing is they're just adding more ish more more updates, more issues that nobody cares about instead of really just taking some time, you know, just take a few years, do very minor updates to Windows, you know, do the security updates and such things, and just really start rewriting the code, you know, a lot of the code within Windows is decades old at this point, you know, so unfortunately this is why mac os users for example laugh at us because well the thing is their os is more stable you know they don't really get these updates that break features obviously they also do get them they just don't get them nearly as frequently as we do because uh this is just ridiculous i mean pretty much every single time a new windows 11 update is released these days uh it might fix a bunch of issues you know sure so that's great uh, but inevitably, there's also a few more random issues that it creates. Uh, so, in my opinion, and in the opinion of a lot of people that I've talked to uh, within this industry, Microsoft should just chill with the new features. They should just take time and they should just rewrite a lot of the Windows code, you know, just clean everything up. So when you will be adding new features, you won't be breaking a ton of old features because now we are, we are just in this never ending cycle of new features being added and old features as well as new features just not working after the updates, which is obviously very annoying uh, because it's obviously annoying when you can't get your work done, right?